cheese in it, boys. Raspberry really pulls it all together. Buy it now. Do it. Do it now. Big money, big prizes. I love it. Last beer. Um, not really related to the game at all. It's Seeds of Darkness. So you could argue that uh, darkness pertains to Moonlighter in a certain way, doesn't it? But this is a fruited sour with raspberry and strawberry from Heathen. Oh, this this guy. Guy. Oh my god. I hate him so much. Get. Ugh. Not off to a good start now. Yeah, you too. This guy's also a huge pain in the ass. The ranged weapons do really well against him, though. Okay, nothing in that room. Oh, there's the boss. Interesting. Am I on floor two, right? Cheers, guys. Yeah. Ah. Raspberry really pulls it all together, I think. So good to heathen to uh, include that. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, I just want the friggin' there you go. I want that back. The rest can go. Alright, that's pretty good. So if you guys uh, weren't on earlier, what that means is that room I just visited lets me unload my whole inventory. Holy shit. Into the shop without having to go back, which is, like, huge. So even if I die, all this shit I've collected this run goes back, which is awesome. Because I probably will die, judging by my performance so far on this stage. So that was huge to find that. Um, I don't know how often it comes up. It might be, like, once every map or something. But yeah, that's massive. Um... Dick. I don't know how to fight that guy, to be honest. Take it all. Okay, I hope you sent that back. Um, what's a new one? Oh, I got a new weapon. Holy shit. I think. Oh no, that's the same same weapon I have. Yeah, okay. That's still pretty awesome though. Nope, I did not switch weapons. Bullshit. Ah. Oh. Well, uh, that's still pretty damn good. I'm not gonna open the shop quite yet. Let's get the new merchant here. This guy. Larry Taylor. Ah. Sweet. What's your deal? Oh, they just sell shit. Alright. So it's like if I, if you don't if you need to get shit without going to the dungeon, this is where you go to get it, I guess. Julian. Hmm. Oh yeah, see so you can buy shit. Um that's kinda good because like if you end up you know, you want to sell shit and you're like, ah oh, I didn't craft this weapon, I don't have it. He only seems to... Okay, so... Oh, he has potions, though. 
that are cheap, way cheaper than the other girls, so that is good to know, man. Alright, cool. Alright, nice. Well, that's, uh, that's a development for sure. Let's open her up. Guess I gotta put some shit on the shelf, huh? Oh, I have nothing. <laughs> Hang on. We'll get you. <laughs> Let's see. Cheers, guys, if you're still watching. Thanks for hanging out this late. Uh, I know it's almost bedtime, but... I'm not gonna lie, this game's pretty addicting, man. So I'm warning you guys now. If you want to start it, just keep that in mind. I got you, man. Sell that shit. All right. All right, so my next goal is 4,000 to get the catch register that gets 10% more money. Uh, Cause that just is, it's like a no brainer, man. I mean, in fact, I should have bought that way before I bought the stupid sale rack thing, but sale rack is like half the price, so fuck it. And they're passing it over. I mean, it's like, it's funny cause they're buying shit that's like the same items that are on the the main shelf, but they're passing over the sale rack. It's like, what? What? It's getting a little, a little bit darker out, you know? They're loving it. Oh, it's getting dark. Hurry up, buy the rest of this shit. We got one more dungeon run, I think, to go, and then that might be it. I'd really like to get to the second biome at least in this run. That third boss was tough, though. I don't know. I might have to do some upgrading before I can get there. We're almost up to the four grand, uh, the four grand mark. So maybe. Uh, Maybe I shouldn't close the shop quite yet here. I see, so the sales rack there, they just buy it straight up. They don't have to come to the register, they just pay for it immediately. Wow, they're gone. Look at that. Well, it's the end of the day. Four, four grand, though. Uh, damn. Let's go ahead and upgrade the shop with our badass cash register. Yes, sir. 10% more money. No brainer. Gotta do it. One more run in the dungeon, and then I think we're. That'll be it for tonight. But this game is pretty cool. You guys should uh, check it out if you. If you're on Epic Games, chances are you already have it, so that's nice. And if not, thanks to Kent, Kent Lee, for uh, the heads up that it's only six bucks or six fifty on uh, the Steam sale. So that's pretty sweet. Definitely worth it. Uh, I played it for now. It looks like almost six hours, and I've like not stopped. It's pretty fun. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Love this. That was pretty sweet. Alright, we're moving on. Next level. Cheers. Alright, we're going up. Let's go. Boys, this is going a little too well. 
Gold chest. Take it all. Okay, hold on. Move you down, yeah. Ooh. How about we send... We'll send you to the shop. How about that shit? Right? Yeah. Okay, next biome here. Not a problem. Ooh, some new shit. Aw, oh, you hit me. How dare you. I burn five potions. Or I just go back. I'm gonna go back. That was that was kind of abysmal. Uh could have could have been better. So let's see how we did here. With items at least. Oh yeah, I better open the shop up. Gotta do that. So these mofos buy shit. Some really good deals on that sales rack, you guys aren't looking. <laughs> it's just like, the shit I'm overloading on. Passing over that sale rack. Come on. Sale doesn't mean like it's bad. Not a bad product. Come on. Buy more shit. There's deals to be had. You guys gotta, gotta look for them. <laughs> oh, I sold the eight stack of that uh, whetstone or whatever the fuck it was. <laughs> Granny, yeah, Granny spends a lot, I gotta say. It's good for me. I guess she needs a lot of shit. She's probably just stockpiling in her house with all the cats. Oh man, I sold out of everything. I think that's, I'm gonna call it, man. Call it a day. This barbarian motherfucker coming in. You can buy all my sales rack shit, you know what? I don't really care. Let's close the store. Get the fuck out. Oh, interesting. So when you close the store, it just liquidates the uh, the sales rack. Okay, I only made 19, 1979, almost two grand. Not not amazing, I gotta say, uh, but not terrible either. It's just kind of yeah. That's I mean that's not ideal. Look, I can say that much. Shit, and I can't stack stuff. How much is the extra storage? Let's look at that. I don't have enough money to, like, uh, offload a bunch of shit to, like, maybe upgrade something. So let's see. Four grand! Holy fuck! So I'm only halfway there. Uh, so that's not happening anytime soon. And this might be the last one, boys. I really wish I could unlock that second biome. We'll see how this goes. If I pick the right way to go, maybe. Alright, well, um... Oh, man, I didn't even see that was sinking. Chest. Oh yeah, I gotta burn some shit. Uh, I guess I could do that when uh, the stacks get bigger, too, so... Make more money, right? Oh, good, I love the trap rooms. That's all right. <laughs> Border? This game? Absolutely. I 
guess IRL too when it comes to beer. I mean, shit. Alright, no problem. I'm already full. Okay, let's burn some stuff here. Okay. You're gone. Um, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone. I'm just gonna go nuts here. Let's go burn stuff that's like... Yeah. Yeah, all of it. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. No, no, no. No, no. Why did I sell the bow out for that? That was terrible. What? What is happening? Why am I still getting hit? Okay, there's a thing. Okay, got it. Um, that was bad. That was really bad. I mean, not that bad. I didn't lose. I didn't lose that much health, but um, I should have been hit at all during that encounter. So that was kind of. I. Again, I'm not a min-max kind of player, but it's like, at a certain point, there's like no excuse, you know? It's like you have to just really be super drunk or just really sloppy for that kind of thing to happen. I mean, I'm kind of there. I mean, I'm not too bad, but yeah. I, I don't agree that... Uh, that encounter, I shouldn't have taken any damage. Let's put it that way. Alright. Another war room. Great. Doesn't do anything for me. If you were to give me, like, an item, or, like, make the town better, like, something that would help me there, I'd be more excited for the lore, but... You guys don't have shit for me. How am I... Why are you not swinging your sword the right way? I don't understand. I'm telling you, swing it at the big fucking thing in the middle of the room. That's the strategy there. Uh, all right. Holy shit. All right, that went okay. Um... Alright, uh, let's see. Not a dead end, which is good. Oh, here we go. Alright, here's the boss. Not full, let's go. Oof! That's a good hit. Yeah, look at that. Sweet. Okay, let's burn some shit one-offs here. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Uh, you're worthless to me. You. You. All right, cool. We're through it. That went pretty well, actually. Okay, where are we at? Oh, I don't know how I killed that thing, to be honest. Oh, the pot again? Pot blocked. Josh, you were right. It's some more shit. over there. Don't like that. No.
know how to fight this fucker, man. You can't hit him until he's like right on top of you and he does some damage. I don't know. I really don't understand. You have to, it's like, there's no way to fight him unless you get hit. That's bullshit. I mean, realistically, let's see. Three health potions. If I knew where the boss room was already, which I don't, um, I'd be in a much better position to make the judgment call, but I think I have to, at three grand, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the plug and take off with what I got because, I mean, the game's just gonna fuck me over. I just know it. I gotta get killed by some bullshit thing. You gotta cut your losses and run sometimes. And that's what's going on here. Uh, I got a lot of loot, at least. Let's open the shop. I mean, not the ideal outcome, because I really want to unlock the second biome, but hey. You know, you don't always win them, right? So, do what you can. Making big plays, big sales. Big money, big prizes. I love it. Oh, yeah. Salty, man. Yeah. Can't resist a good deal, come on. Aw, uh, yeah. Buy it up. Buy it now. Do it, do it now. Shit, it's almost nighttime. Y'all wasting my fucking time. I got six grand. They're not buying shit, it's already night. Close the fucking store. Get the fuck out of here. Not buying shit anyway. Get the fuck out. Oop. <laughs> I hit the. I always hit the wrong button. Stack it. How much do we make here? Let's see. 2600. Uh, not great. Okay, I made 21 potions. We are set for like several dungeon adventures um, where I don't lose some potions when I die. So let's figure that fucking shit out right now. All right, so send them, send them, send them. Okay, that's that. Uh. What can I burn in the dungeon here? Okay, how about a single stack? Yeah, that's fine. And then we send them. Cool, lots of potions in the bank. Uh, and we can do one more dungeon run and then call it a night, I think. All right, so the beer I grabbed was uh, Super Light. It's a IPA. This is Colin Robinson from Standard. If you guys aren't watching what you do in the shadows, sorry, what we do in the shadows, uh, you guys are missing out because that series is amazing. And this is a, a fantastic beer uh, dedicated to that show. And this is, this is really good. Okay, so one more dungeon run in us here. Uh, oh, God. Of course, I start off in a bullshit room. You know, you think about like how many games copied uh, Zelda for the dungeon design, like Isaac, this game. I mean, I'm sure there's countless more, but it's like, those are the ones I can think of off the top of my head. And it's not like, it's not a slight against the games at all, because it makes sense, like the kind of per room thing. But it's funny to think about how many indie games did that shit. Give me some... Oh, my God. Uh, 
Okay, that could have gone a lot worse, actually. That was not too bad. <laughs> I hate those... Those jello fucking monsters that, uh... Absorb you like that. I really hate that. Dude, Maddox and uh, Malfunct, man. Standard is cranking out beer like you would not believe, dude. Like, every week they're coming out with something new. It's consistency, too. It's good quality, you know? So you guys, uh... You should give them a look, man. Okay, there's the boss room. Sweet. It's actually good to know. Uh, no big deal. Hey, here's the boss already. All right, I, I gotta try. Let's make sure, yeah, we have the things. We have the things that are in place that need to be in place. The th things I wanna keep are there. All right, let's go. Ah, he got me. Okay, um, I'm going to go ahead and try to fight the boss. Um, oh no, we're not fighting yet, I forgot. You don't get to go right to the boss. You have to fight your way through a bunch of bullshit before you get to go to the boss. At least it's a gold chest of shit I can't fucking carry. Oh no, I can kind of carry it. Yeah, that works out. Okay. Can I heal more? Because um, I kind of need it. That's a no. That's a negative Ghost Rider. Oh god, I have four healing potions. This is bad. Oh, fucking A. I'm probably going to die here. I don't know how to dodge this his fucking... Nightmare right here. These things. <sighs> yeah, I can't dodge that. That stupid fucking thing. Oh, there's no way. There's no fucking way. Dude, I got 7,100 bucks. I mean, that run was kind of a bust, but uh, we're looking pretty good here. I might be able to craft something. Let's see. What's my armor situation? Yeah. I want a bigger backpack. How the fuck do I get that? Ah, oh, bummer.
Oh, here we go. All right. Okay. Oh, iced them. Iced them. I think that's only fair. Fuck. Oh, that was bad. Oh, man, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. Well, all right. I think I'm going to call it a night. Uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, Maddox, I know you're still out there, but if anybody else is on, thank you guys for hanging out for me. Hanging out with me for seven and a half, just about seven and a half hours. That just goes to show you how addicting this game is. The combination of the dungeon crawling, like the Zelda style dungeon crawling with the uh, West Reseteer shop management aspect is really appealing. Um, I hope you guys, uh, if, you, if you're on Epic Games, you probably got this game for free. Go check it out. Load it up and play it. It's really fun. And then, of course, as always, we had some fantastic beers. So cheers to that if you're still on. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me so long. This has been great. This has been really fun. The YouTube game right now is really hard. I mean, Twi Twitch too is really hard to break through. So the only way I can do this is if you guys like, subscribe, follow all the bullshit. I know it sucks. I know it's annoying, but just like and subscribe. Comment on my videos. Tell me like what you think about what I'm doing. Um, it really does help the algorithm. It helps promote me, that kind of thing. So if you guys can do that, it'd be really, really useful. Um, really helpful you know uh thanks for supporting me and thanks for uh hanging out as i play these games and we can shoot the shit and drink some fucking good beer so cheers to that but i went way longer than i planned and uh that's not a bad thing it's just that uh there's got to be a point where i gotta call it because all this has to get edited down in the YouTube videos, so seven and a half hours, that's more than enough time, so. Yes, Maddox, uh, as the Rona clears up, I do plan to stream beer tastings, absolutely. And brewery visits and all these kinds of things, like lots of, uh, lots of big plans. Um, but yes, we have to wait until it's safe to do so. Uh, and that's just the unfortunate reality of it all, but that's how it goes so cheers uh hey thank you again anybody who's still on i know maddock you're there but anybody else thank you all for watching especially so late in the night cheers um i hope it was fun and uh i'm glad to have you and i hope uh you'll i'll see you for the next one so cheers <laughs>